Good morning. Good afternoon or good evening. And how are you today? Good morning. Good afternoon or good evening. Here's the daily crumb. Help you love your way. Good morning or good afternoon or good evening. Whatever time it is, it's for you. Welcome to the Daily Crime with me. We usually met for Jackie Quiet. Your friendly, freaky ass, sweet grass wanted medicine woman. Also, Christiana Carr. Chris Carr, superstar. All this beautiful divine being right here. Welcome. Oh, you beautiful divine beings right here too. How goes it with you? Yes, my PSW was here. So today I'm getting this in a little later than I did last week, but before my B in the advance uh, program that starts at 11. So here we go. Here we go. I'm getting bold and busy. Oh, yeah. Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Huh? Okay. Let me have a sip of this. Starting to get clearer. Yeah. There's still a little, you know, a little bit. I'm blowing it all out, cleansing it all out. Here we go. Here we grow. Okay. Let's dive in here. What is our self-care for today? <sighs> Got to get out of the rushing, right? Come here. We have time. There's always, always time. Here, but we're gonna take the one on top of here. Oh, okay, okay. And then there was two that flew up here, so we're looking at this because if monks and nuns do not cherish their time of practice, they will have nothing to offer the world. Take that come. Find peace in your extraordinary efforts. Your work is not in vain. Six materialization of our talents, right? Bringing that out in the world, getting bold and visible, whatever that is for you, sharing that work that you have, sharing your gifts, right? purpose of life is to find your you know the meaning of life is to find your gift the purpose is to give it away something like that somebody else shared that i saw that on the bnv it was shared there and then it was shared again today let's say have patience with all things but first of all with yourself what francis de sales write down ways in which you can be more patient with yourself Keep this list handy and reference when needed. Do you need more patience with yourself? Mm. Maybe are we impatient with ourselves because somebody else didn't have patience with us? I don't know. What is that for you? That's a 34. That's a 7. A 6, 7. Up to the next step. So what is that? Are you patient with you? Are you patient with that little in you? I don't know. When you recognize and reflect on even one good thing about yourself, you're building a bridge to a place of kindness and caring. That's uh, Sharon Salzberg. Write down your favorite trait about yourself. What's your favorite thing about you? Celebrate why you love this about yourself. What's your favorite thing about you? What is your favorite thing about you? you Ooh, and do you celebrate that too right there's a practice we go and we we, we go and we, we look to the stuff then we criticize right we crit we critique ourselves so much but let's 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 start making a practice of looking at what we do like what we do appreciate and celebrating that in us right we're not all bad like come on what, what you can't be all that bad what's something good about you and that's where asking that trusted friend some advice there too. Hey, what's good about me? I'm just not seeing it. You know, like I'm just feeling so hard on myself these days, right? But what is that for you? When you recognize and reflect on even one, just one good thing about yourself, you are building a bridge to a place of kindness and caring, right? And feeling more at home, in your natural home, Right, because we can't escape ourselves. Hey, and that's a 58, which would make a 13, which would be a four. Balancing 
that balancing all that we are releasing all that we are not oh i guess it was not paid okay i got distracted by call coming in about my van <laughs> sir the financial abuse still happened then ah <laughs> yeah yeah because now that affects my credit too so not only can make the payment late and all of that and that was one thing that was really building my credit was my van. I'm looking at sizes, it's parked right there. So, anyways, we can't be discouraged. Find some, you know, that's one thing I love about myself. No matter how hard people try and make it for me, I still keep going. I still keep growing. I choose to feel the bitter and grow wiser because I'm human. I feel all those emotions. Yes, I do. But I wish them blessings too. So anyways, I only got about 5000 left. Anybody got like 5000 to help me pay off this van? You can send me money anytime. So I appreciate it. <coughs> I try not to look at me and ask it for money. All right, all right. I need a hand up, not a hand out, okay? Then when the business gets going, I will share that. Pay it forward, give back, pay it forward, and just keep it going, keep it growing. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's what we'll do. When you're helping out me, you're helping others too. It's not just me. The buck does not stop here <laughs> spread it around and I, I've known because I've lived in poverty all my life that I know how to make the most out of little bits so I spread them out make crumbs make a feast out of the crumbs mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. keep a watch out that will be my book coming out <coughs> excuse me okay eventually eventually I will write a biography. Maybe. I don't know. Sounds okay. Oh, that's an, I, I, I love that I'm playful. I'm serious about living my life, but I don't take life too seriously. Okay, there we go. We're taking those ones and put those all back together. Oh, this is tickling my nose. It's driving me crazy. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Itchy nose. Gonna kiss the pool. Okay. It was tickled. My hair was tickling my nose. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's something on my face. That's a sensory thing, right? My hair tickles my face. I'm like, I want to scratch my face off. Okay. What keeps coming up here? <coughs> <coughs> is that timing? The time is nigh. <laughs> We're following it. It's, it's internal rhythm internal timing but we're connecting with that divine timing right that that divine clock inside of us whatever that is is for you right and then we have the oh, diversion what have we been what the hey what's upside down here what's upside down here how did that get all oh, because i just put them back that way okay no worries no worries because there was a clump that came out that was upside I didn't even look at them. I didn't look at their faces. So I just put them back. So the diversions. Have we been diverting ourselves? Or are we waiting for this? I'm not going to make the move till this happens or whatever. And look at that. Reflect. Shuns, right? We're waiting for that time. We're waiting for that divine time. But we're missing that call because it's still quiet. And are, are, are we ignoring that? Or, you know, we need something bigger. Okay. God, give me the fireworks when it's time for me to move, right? Have you ever sat at a stop sign waiting for it to turn green? <laughs> I don't know. What is that uh, for you are we holding ourselves back is there something that's coming up uh mm, we're second guessing ourselves look at that original source is with us it's that magic got to get out of our own way and let that magic happen the world work life happen as you there we go we're going to go over a little bit rites of passage to change what are we doing that inner wisdom and that inner knowing something needs to change something's got to give we're changing the way we look at ourselves we're changing the way we look at life whatever that is for you we're loving ourselves right embracing and celebrating those things that we love about ourselves what is your favorite thing about you all right biggest heart hugs ever yes thank you for being you and shining light through and everything you do because you know this world loves you thank you for being here thank you for choosing to stay every day love you Mwah.